Late last summer, I found a bag of cracked corn in the shed, so I would spread some out on the tree stumps to see what animals would come around. The first one to take advantage of a free meal was Mr. Chips, but shortly thereafter, a pair of cardinals would come every evening and have a snack on the logs. They were always together, so I figured they were a couple, and being a senile old man, I would talk to the animals. I told the cardinals, next spring I expect to be made a grandfather. Well, spring came and sure enough, Mrs. Cardinal started building a nest in the tree right in front of my door. Every day I would watch as she built the nest and then as she laid the eggs and then as she fed the chicks. Then one day there was a commotion in the trees. Mrs. Cardinal was chirping like crazy. And so when I went to take a look, I noticed that one of the chicks was missing. There he is, on top of the tree. Mrs. Cardinal seemed to be making a big fuss and Not being too familiar with the habits of birds, I thought that maybe she was worried because he had left the nest. So I put him back in the nest. But he wasn't having it. No sooner had I put him in the nest than he started to try and get away again. I came back a couple of hours later and Mrs. Cardinal was still making a big fuss and when I looked there were two chicks missing. This little fellow was stuck on the side of the deck and so I thought I better put him back into the tree. So I picked him up and carried him over to the tree. And then where was the other guy? Well, he was on top of the trestle. So I picked him up too, and I put him back in the tree. When I came back a couple of hours later, they were both gone. Only a little sister was left and she was sitting in the top of the tree. So I gave her a little pet and told her not to worry, mommy will be back soon. When I came back two hours later, they were gone. I could hear them in the trees. They were up pretty high and so there was no chance of me going to retrieve them and bring them back to the nest. Mrs. Cardinal would fly around and feed them from branch to branch. This went on for a couple of days and then everyone disappeared. When I looked into the tree, I saw an empty nest with one solitary egg left, one that hadn't hatched. I felt a little bit sad that they were gone. For three weeks I passed by them several times a day and and peeked through the foliage to see how they were doing. It felt like my own little family and now they were all gone. But they've come back and I can hear their chirping and I call to them and they come down and they eat their treaty snacks from the top of the logs. And that is the story of the Cardinals.